Hi guys, it's me Andrea. I will show you today a very easy, easy and quick art journal page with a little easy technique for texture. And uh, these are my relief paste from Marabou. They are for glass outlining. And what I do, I quite like to to outline with them, give texture outline and, and write with them. But normally I, I use most of it. The, the white and the black. Never use this color color one. So I use them up for texture, put them under under paint because I don't really like the color. So yeah. But that's what I do. And um I used here um this or I drew this um, flower down and <clears throat> sorry what's important is when you do this leave little gaps don't fill in the whole pattern because you need these gaps later to get the textures with all the, out with all the paint you're putting on. You will see that later. And <clears throat> sorry, just when I start my voice over, fantastic. And um, yeah, so this stuff needs about 15, 20 minutes to dry, and then I can go on working. And what I do here, I of course don't want to have this color shining through. I put several layers of. Uh, gesso on top, let it, let it dry, next layer, let it dry, next layer and so on. And the very last layer is a heavy gesso and that made it. So um, this is part of a hop. Uh, I, I think you, you realize that by now. <laughs> and um, what I wanted to do here is, this is one of my favorite techniques and I, I really want to show you how easy it is to make an art journal page, make a little artwork and um, yeah, work in this technique. You don't need to be a very experienced artist and um, I think, yeah, I like it a lot and I hope you do and, and I hope I can inspire you. So <clears throat> what I do here after everything dried properly, I put the first layer of my paint down. It's a very warm yellow and I put everything down with my fingers now because it's important that you can feel all the texture that you fill in all the little gaps and I leave it drying completely the next step is this warm orange I put on top and I dry that a tiny bit and uh, I go over with my hair I try to find out it's not dry enough I need to my heat tool so and then I partially remove it with my baby wipe and you can see the stainy edges I really like this effect absolutely love it so the next one is a green green olive here and again put it over with my fingers and yeah, I can feel where I want to have it and that's why I like to use my fingers especially when I use with te uh, work with textured stuff so and as I said before that's part of a hop and um, a lot of people taking part, fantastic people, really fantastic artists. So, you know, easy thing, go into my description box after you've watched here and you can go on the very first link, click on that and that will lead you to the next video and so on. You do that with the next one as well. But it would be nice if you leave some thumbs up and uh, a nice comment before you go to the next video, that would be nice. So that this step is my tur green turquoise and I spread it out a bit longer or a bit, not longer, I spread it out a bit wider and I wanted to have a bigger part and um, I use again my baby wipe, that's dry enough now, I don't need my heat tool and I'm only wiping over it very carefully and spread it out a tiny bit here with the baby wipe. So to get the texture out, I use this wet violet and I go slightly, slightly over the textured area. Um, not too much pressure, pressure so that I stay mainly on the raised areas. So that's what I do and I'm not doing any more. It's, it's uh, no line outlining, no sketchy lines, nothing. The only thing, because I like this diffuse look, you know, the only thing I do is some marks here and there with a little plastic tube and here the the end of a brush 
with some white dots with gesso and that's almost it and to bring the whole page together I use my acrylic ink here in black that um, yeah I finish this page off I don't know if you know I think you know what I mean that it's connected and that's all I will now I will put some um, secret journaling on yeah um no one can read that actually uh, I know what it means and I don't want other people don't know or I don't want that's a secret you know it's my my secret secret thoughts and I don't want people to be able to read that so okay so I haven't got a close-up today but pictures are following now and I hope you like it give me some thumbs up and um, as I said before go to the description box have a look everything's explained and um, yeah go to the first link and have a look for the next artists I hope to you stick with us with a whole hop and having fun so I hope I see you soon again have a fantastic time guys bye bye